is urging new mothers to consider donating breast milk. Amy Walker's daughter survived for 52 days. She'd been fed a mixture of Amy's breast milk and milk donated by other women. Nikki Mitchell has the story. Akemi weighed just one pound and two ounces when she was delivered three months before her due date. We didn't know if she was going to survive. I just bawled my eyes out because she was so tiny. I put my hand in there. I was, so, I was shaking. I was so scared. I didn't want to harm her. But she held my finger. Akemi's condition improved with the help of her mother's own expressed breast milk, which was supplemented by milk donated to the John Radcliffe Hospital's special milk bank. Giving preterm babies donated breast milk instead of formula significantly reduces their risk of developing a potentially fatal condition called necrotizing enterocolitis, the same disease which eventually ended Akemi's life shortly after formula milk was introduced into her diet. I just want more mothers to be aware of what you could do to help if you donate breast milk and how many lives it can save. I wouldn't wish this on anyone, never, because it's just the most heartbreaking thing, losing your daughter. Nikki Mitchell with that report. If you'd like to find out more about milk donation, there's information available from the UK Association for Milk Banking website. That's ukamb.org slash yourmilkbank. Three of our region's sides are in midweek action in the Football League tonight.